back here with Carolina Fathom. Uh, today we're going to be doing a video on making a homemade archery target. Uh, not too long ago I bought a bow and arrow. Uh, I've been hunting with it but I've been having to go all the way out to Dunn Outdoors to shoot my bow. So today we're going to be making a video using some repurposed wood as well as some cardboard I had laying around the house and we're going to be making a, a target. So let's get into that kind of show you all the wood that we're going to be using there's some posts that i found in the yard they don't look too pretty but we want to sand them up and uh, get them looking right uh, went ahead and cut this one as clean as i could and then i have to do this to the other one and then i got to get the cardboard cut put it in there and we'll be shooting at the at the target here soon also have this cardboard right here i had a hot water heater uh, replaced at my house and this big box came with it perfect for what i'm going to be using that for so i'm going to be cutting them to size kind of about the size of that maybe just a little bit bigger of that flap um, and then kind of layering it up as much as i can with the rest of this cardboard Alright you guys, so I just wanted to give you an update on what we have here. Uh, we have 16 layers of cardboard wrapped in three layers of duct tape. It's just some regular duct tape. This is the end of the roll. This is black duct, duct tape. Had, uh, two layers of that and then I had a layer of electrical tape underneath all of this. So yeah, let's go put the post in the ground and get everything set up and let's shoot some arrows at this thing. All right, so this is kind of the final product. This is kind of what I had in mind. It's just a post set up just to hold the block of cardboard that we have in here. Easily removable. That way you can build yourself another one. You just slap it in there and you're ready to go. But yeah, let's shoot some, uh, let's shoot some arrows at it. We're going to go ahead and be shooting at the target and see kind of uh, if it holds up. We're at 25 yards. We got my uh, compound bow, 60 pound draw uh, with some field tips. We're going to see if it does it. All right, so it did exactly what it was supposed to do. It was supposed to stop it. So we just scooted the camera back. We're now at 40 feet. I made a uh, error in the last little video that I made. Said I was at 25 yards. I was not at 25 yards. I was at 25 feet. That was my fault. We're at 40 yards now, and we're going to see what it does at 40 yards. So here we go. at 40 feet.
That's good because we hit it. So. That one might have been a little high, but let's take a look at it. All right, so at 40 feet, that's where we're hitting, and it's doing the same exact thing. So it kind of doesn't matter how far you are, it's going to stop it just about the same. So, bang. So there you have it, guys. That easy, you can have a backyard archery target right here set up just with some uh, wood that I literally found over here with all this fence material and these little two by fours that I found over there with it. Uh, so there it is, uh, 16 layers of cardboard wrapped in some duct tape. And that's how I made my archery setup. So thank you for watching. If y'all can like, comment, subscribe, and we'll be making more videos.